Hi, I'm Paul Gervin from the King's Links Golf Centre here in Aberdeen. Um, today I'd like to attempt to help those of you who may have a particular problem with the high pitch shot or the lob shot as it's known. I guess the, the main purpose of this show is to have the ball landing as softly on the green as possible with very, very little forward momentum. Um, First and foremost, you're going to use your most lofted wedge in the bag, whether that be a 60 or a 58 or a 56 degree sand wedge. Uh, the most lofted one I carry is 58 and we're going to use that today. First of all, in, in the setup, you're going to uh, adopt your normal setup for, for a chip shot, which would be a narrow stance with the weight towards the left side. Toe lines slightly open, slightly aiming left of target. But in this one, it's so important that you play the ball forward in your stance towards your left heel. If you play the ball back in your stance, you're going to play more of a, a running shot, more of a direct shot. So this time, we're going to play the ball towards the left side. The club face itself, you really don't want to play with the, with the club face closed, therefore you're taking all the loft off it. So you want to have the club face square or to play a more extreme shot, you'd have the club face more open. So, ball position forward is a main key here. Weight towards the left side, taking my standard grip, normal grip, club face slightly open. When the club swings back, when you get to waist height, the club face has to be in a toe-up position. If the club face is in a closed position, again, we're going to take the loft off the club face and get more of a low running shot. So a good idea is to check where the club face is halfway back. We need to have the toe pointing towards the sky. Okay, let's go and hit one or two. Okay, that was fine. Equally on the follow through, when you turn through, the toe of the club again is going to be pointing to the sky. So we don't want it shut, we don't want to roll the hands over here. Again, that's taking all the loft off that club face. And it's going to give the ball the forward run that we don't want in the shot. So, we've got our most lofted wedge, we've got the ball forward in the stance, we've got the weight forward, maybe 60% on the left side. I'm taking my normal grip, swing the club face back to waist height, the toe of the club pointing up, and then turn through, face the target. Bingo, we've got the shot we want. Now, if you need help with this shot, um, there's five teaching pros down here at the King's Links. We're more than happy to help you with, with this shot. I think it's a real stroke saver for you.